What is going on guys, Bodak Steve here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Polaris Lance Catalyst and the quickest way to get it upgraded. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to Anna Bray and pick up that fifth and final quest step. Our first objective is to get 15 multi-kills with the Javelin. The quickest way to get this step done is to either do the Warsat public event or start up an Escalation Protocol. Once you've gotten 15 multi-kills with the Javelin, we're going to have to complete three PvP matches. Now you do not have to win or use the Polaris Lance during any of these matches, you literally just have to do three of them. Next we gotta head back to Mars and disrupt the Hive Ritual. This is the Nocris Strike mission, but it is not the Strike version. This is the story version, so you can go through it solo with ease. Heard a noise. Oh, nice, Tether. <laughs> Holy oh my crap. Gosh. <laughs> Once you've killed that boy, we gotta find another node or cache found in Alton Dynamo. Now, you have probably seen this node before and wondered what it's for, and it's actually a part of this quest. So it's in the room with a couple knights and a bunch of thrall, and it's just chilling in the middle. Once you've found the node, you can go upload the memory to the fifth and final terminal, and Anna Bray is going to give you that exotic catalyst for the Polaris Lance. Now what you're going to have to do to upgrade the Polaris Lance's masterwork is defeat around 800 enemies and get 50 perfect fifth kills. And this is the difficult part because you would think that the perfect fifth kills were on the explosion, but you actually have to get kills with the burn effect from the perfect fifth explosion. Acolytes are going to be your best friend when it comes to getting these perfect fifth kills. So what you're going to want to do is get to the perfect fifth charged shot and then shoot that shot directly underneath the acolyte's feet. What it's going to do is explode and it will burn their health all the way to none. They have just enough health where they will die from the burn as long as you do not shoot them. The best location to do this is in the Lost Sector that you're seeing gameplay of right now. It is the Core Terminus Lost Sector located in Futurescape over by Anna Bray. Two pro tips I have for this quest are when you go into the Lost Sector, shoot the Knight to get the precision hits to charge it up because they take more health and that means you'll have more acolytes to kill. Number two, if you're a hunter, be sure to put on the dodge where you'll reload ammo because if you are low on ammo and you don't want to worry about missing a precision hit, you can dodge and you won't lose your charged shots. If you use my method, you will be done with the perfect 5th kills in no more than 30 minutes, then all that you have to do is just get kills with the Polaris Lance. So what does the Polaris Lance Catalyst actually do? Well, whenever you get precision kills, it creates an elemental damage explosion. It is instantaneous. So basically, whenever you get a kill with it, it'll explode and damage anything around it. On top of, you will also have the perfect 5th exotic perk. So this thing drops when it comes to, you know, lower level ads or anything like that. So overall, do I like it? I do. It's fun. It's fun to use. It does feel exotic. It makes me feel like I'm doing something that no other weapon can do. This is really fun because if you land those precision headshots, you're going to get the elemental damage explosion, and then you're going to get the perfect fifth explosion, and you don't have to reload ammo. So there's a lot of perks to it, it's really fun. If you're going through strikes, you're going to drop all of the ads. So overall, it's it was worth the grind. It was fun to use, I really like it, and I am gonna use it in the future. But that's gonna do it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like if this helped you get the Polaris Lance Catalyst, and I'll catch you all in the next one.